Hello everyone. My name is Jojo. Welcome to my channel Joyroot Jojo. This is a seventh video in the Intune tutorial series. Please check the description or the end screen page to watch the previous videos. All right. In this video, let's check compliance policy notifications. Once the device marked as non-compliant, how come the end user know that his or her device is non-compliant? Let's take a look. Presently, we are in the Intune Admin Center. We are going to click on the device blade. Scroll down and you could see compliance here. Click on the compliance. You could see we have already created a Windows compliance policy here. And in the policy, we have mentioned three conditions to mark the device as compliant, like minimum OS version is 10, maximum OS version should be 11, and firewall should be turned on to mark the device as compliant. So that we have already done it. Now we'll go to the notifications. You could see the, the blade called notification here. Click on that. Here we create the notification. Through this notification, we shall notify the end user via email that your device has marked as non-compliant. Kindly inform or meet the administrator to take appropriate actions. So let's create a notification and see the settings there. I have already created one compliance message, one email message that will be shared while device marked as non-compliant. Let that be there. We'll create a new one. To create that, you have to click on create notification and you have to name it. We'll name it like email message for non-compliance. We'll click on next. If you have to show the company logo, you can enable that. It's not required in my case. Enable footer, show the company name. Uh, let it be enabled. Show contact information. Let it be there. Okay, so these are the general settings. Uh, I am keeping it as uh, default. Let's move on. Here comes the notification message template. So we can add one template here. First, we have to select the language. Language we create as English or uh, United Kingdom, or you keep uh, English United States. Subject again non compliance. Lines message. And the message you have to type it here. Message is something like uh, your mission is non compliant. Kindly meet the IT administrator, IT administrator. Let's save this and limit the IT administrator. Okay, fine. We'll save the message. Okay. We'll edit that change, select the default template. Uh, set this set to default local. Okay, I'm saving this. So let's click on next review and create it. Okay, so now we have got two notification email. So now we'll go to the compliance policy and we'll edit it again. Okay, clicking on the compliance policy here, we'll go to the properties and here action for non compliance. We'll edit that again. So what action to be taken for non-compliance so that we specify here first thing mark the device as non-compliant immediately if we mention zero that it's as immediately and second thing send a email to the end user and we have selected the template some template we had selected the old one here compliance message so we had created two notification in the device compliance notification bar and both are displayed here one i had created in the uh, february 21st and the other one on today on march march 2nd so we will keep the old one itself and we'll click select and review and save it now let's see how the message looks like for the end user now i just want to show you from the end user perspective how the email looks like so let's see that uh, as you can see uh, sure ID joined this device as marked as non-compliant so what the message uh, the end user has received let's check that so i am there in the uh, machine 
we'll check the host name once host name we can see Ashwari already joined and I have opened the mail here so on uh, 24th we get a message non-compliance message which says your device is non-compliant only contact the IT administrator if you go to the notifications go to compliance and notification you could see the compliance message what we had created earlier your device is non-compliant kindly contact the IT administrator so the same message is displayed here your device is non-compliant kindly contact the IT administrator so it shows the serial number device name and all the detail OS version and all the other details here so this is the way how we can create the notification and send to the uh, end user via mail as usual one more thing please do subscribe my channel and uh, click on the like button if you really like it and if you have any suggestions or questions please mark it on the comment section that's it goodbye